اما الفاشينيستا زينب الحلو فما اسمى وقتها ما بين لندن ودبي حتى تتابع الموضه وتنقلها معاها من بلد لبلد وهالشيء ساعدها ليصير عندها عدد كبير من المتابعين من كل انحاء العالم العصري والكاجول زينب عندها بصمتها الخاصة اللي بتختلف عن باقي الفاشن بلوجرز فانعرفت بحبها للسبورت شوز والناتشرال لوك اللي بتعتمدوا بالميك اب والشعر ومش بس هيك فهي كمان قدرت تدمج بين الشرق والغرب بالاوتفيتس اللي بتختارهم بكل اطلالة ليها I uh, set up an Instagram basically that was happening in parallel to the corporate business that I was working in and it started developing and a lot of opportunities were coming my way وبعمر صغير اسست البزنس الخاص فيها لتساعد البنات يعملوا شوبينج اون Mostly encouragement and motivation from people that really believed in me and were supporting me on a daily basis. So I took the plunge of leaving and the first couple of months was difficult. Um, but yeah, I mean, after time, you just ended up, you've got to walk before you run. So I managed to do that and I'm still trying. Every day is a new challenge. Whatever anyone tells you and tries to put you down or... You know, you have to kind of go against them and show them. My motivation was when people were like, oh, I don't know if you can succeed, how much money are you going to make? And it was like, no, it's not only about money, it's about making something. Hey, Okay. فشو رأيكم حماسة هذا رح يساعدها بالمواجهة؟ Bring on the next fear. Honestly, I'm ready. Thank you, Nana, for the amazing opportunity to get over my fear.